Hello. Today we will take a look at the task button. The task button contains a group of all the user related operations. When clicking the task button or by hitting F5 keys, we see a list of actions. Create session, enter opening amount, enter closing amount, draw your summary, close session, close session blind, printing is on, return mode is off, reprint last bill, switch user, take deposit. So first we will look at the create session. A session keeps track of all transactions done within the scope of it. Where multi-shift pause operations are present, typically each cashier works in his own session and hands over the terminal to the next cashier by closing his session and transferring all cash balance to the next person. Guinness's pause does not allow any financially sensitive operation in the pause unless a session is created. We will now see how to create a session. We click the create session to create a new session. You would notice that the moment it is done, the previously disabled options are now automatically enabled. Now we would see the next option that is the enter opening amount. At the beginning of each session, the user will always have some cash in hand whether it is a carry forward from the last session or a new allocation from the agent. This amount needs to be reconciled at the end of the day. To do so, it needs to be recorded as the opening amount. To enter the opening amount, click the enter opening amount option in the task button. The enter opening amount window opens up. Put in the amount and click on OK. Now we would see how we would insert the closing amount. To enter the closing amount, at the end of the session, click the enter closing amount option in the task button. The enter closing amount window opens up. Enter the closing amount and click on OK. Now we would see the drawer summary. A drawer summary is a report that is usually automatically generated at the close of a session but can be generated at any time by clicking the drawer summary option in the task button. The drawer summary shows a summary of all the transactions at the terminal in the particular session and is used to tally the sales report at the end of the day. Now we would see the close session. Close session closes the current session. Clicking on it prompts you to ask if you really want to close the session. We say yes. Please note that you have to put in the opening and closing amount before closing any session. The closed session blind is only enabled at the discretion of the admin. Clicking on the printing toggle option turns the printing function on or off. Clicking on the return toggle option turns the return mode on or off. Once turned on, the barcode of the item scanned or entered is marked for return. As we see that the item is, has been marked for return. Reprint last bill option prints the last bill handled by the current cashier. The switch user option allows you to switch the user in the current session. So we see that the user has been switched. The take deposit option allows you to take deposit against a customer. You would know more about this in the tutorials about how to take deposits. So we've gone through all the options in the task button. Subscribe to our channel to know more about Guinnesses. Thank you.